Hi, I'm Erin Morgenstern, author of The Night Circus. My new novel, The Starless Sea, goes on sale this November. One of the inspirations behind The Starless Sea was libraries and bookstores and book-filled spaces. And the story itself actually begins uh, when someone finds a mysterious book on a shelf in a university library. And that one story kind of leads to everything else, like the way like a single book can take you on an adventure. Writing The Starless Sea was a little bit different than writing The Night Circus because I, um, I kind of knew what I was doing, but not really. And I wasn't doing the sort of binge writing that I did for The Night Circus where I wrote like the, the 50,000 words in 30 days and then tried to piece something together. I, but I do, I write very sprawling, messy drafts and it takes me a while to find the story within a space because I always start with a space and try to write my way through it. The hardest thing about writing The Starless Sea was finding the ending. Um, the first hundred or so pages changed very little, but I rewrote the, the last half of the book many, many times until I found where it was meant to be going. When I went to write a second book, I didn't really want to write a sequel to The Night Circus. I felt like The Night Circus ends kind of nicely and, and I could explore the world further, maybe someday, but that wasn't what I wanted to do next. And I wanted to do something um, that still felt fantastical and still felt like that sort of book that I love that plays with um, the edges of genre. And I settled on really wanting to write a book about books. And as I started working on a book about books, I realized that I was actually telling a book about stories um, because it turned into a book that was not only about books themselves and an underground labyrinth full of books, but also a book about fate and time in video games. And that's The Starless Sea. Thank you for visiting the Night Circus, and I hope you enjoy Sailing the Starless Sea.